Hello, now I know what you're thinking. Cybersecurity training, why on earth do I need that? But it's important, honestly it is. Every single day I see people fall victim to these cyber criminals, these hackers. And no, they don't all look like that or that. And believe me, they are coming for you. Cybersecurity is like driving a car. You can have all the safety features in the world turned on, but if you drive recklessly, inevitably it's gonna end up in a crash. And no one wants that. Right now, I wanna talk passwords. Passwords are used to control access to an account or system. Many people today have hundreds of different accounts that require passwords to gain access. Making passwords difficult to crack is key to keeping your account safe from a cyber attack. So what have you got to do with your passwords? Firstly, use 12 or more characters, combining all character types. So that's letters, numbers, and special characters like exclamation marks, dollar signs, and hyphens. Secondly, use a unique password for every single one of your accounts online. And yes, I really do mean every single account. Now, I know what you're thinking, Mystic Meg again, how on earth are you going to remember all of those passwords when you've got hundreds of accounts online, right? Well, here's a little pro tip for you. They are online password managers or a digital password manager. And we recommend you start using one of these and they can be KeyPass or LastPass or there's a mobile app called Codebook. And here's what's great about these password managers is not only can they create a random hard to crack guess password, but they keep them all in a secure vault. And then all you need to remember is the one very strong hard to crack password to access your vault. Thirdly, use two factor authentication on accounts that offer it. You'll probably be familiar with this already, even if you haven't heard of 2FA before. It's the way you log into your online bank account or connect to the office network when you're working remotely. You get sent a one-time passcode, often on your phone, that has a lifespan of anywhere between 30 seconds to about two minutes. And what's great about multi-factor authentication is that if cyber criminals get hold of your password, they can't access your account without this code. So it's another layer of security. So where you can, go and turn this on. And finally, and as obvious as this sounds, never ever share your password with anyone. And that includes IT departments, friends, family members. In this instance, sharing is not caring. They don't need to know it and you don't need to give it out. So that's it for this video. A bit to remember there, but put these things into practice and you'll be a lot safer online. So until next time, stay secure.